What can you do about repeated ankle sprains? I'm Dr. David, orthopedic surgeon and sports medicine specialist, and I provide education, information, and commentary on all sorts of sports and exercise, injuries, injury treatments, injury prevention for athletes and active people so that you can stay healthy and perform your best. I think it's a real challenge, people that deal with ankle sprains, to get over them, especially if they start happening over and over again. And so in today's Ask Dr. Geyer video, I answer the question of what somebody with pain related to basically spraining his ankle over and over again, what can he potentially do about it? Ray asks, I've been having recurrent ankle sprains throughout my four years in university. However, with every inversion sprain, now it tends to hurt on my medial side a lot more than the lateral side. I was wondering if you had any cases of that in your practice and what you'd recommend. So that's a great question and I think there's a couple things. First of all, with the medial pain, I think it's always interesting uh, and worthwhile to go see a doctor and potentially get x-rays to make sure new damage isn't forming. And every time your ankle turns, you run the risk of the bones sort of hitting each other, in this case on the medial side, even though the, it's the lateral side opening up when you roll it that way, you could damage the cartilage or damage the bone under the cartilage, what we call an osteochondral lesion of the talus. And sometimes we'll even need to do something about that surgically, be it just go in with a scope and clean it up or do a microfracture to that area or little cylinders of bone and cartilage. There's a lot of treatment. So sometimes getting an x-ray to make sure you aren't causing any more damage can be a good idea. I think another important thing, I mean I've talked in other videos about bracing and taping and things like that. I think that's really good, especially even after a first one, uh, to try to heal the injury. Whether or not that's a good long-term solution is really a, a different debate. I think it's really important though to work with a physical therapist, rebuild the muscles that stabilize the ankle, and redevelop what we call proprioception and balance. It's sort of a joint position sense. That's where in physical therapy you'll see players and athletes standing on a soft foam surface and try to balance just on that injured ankle or the wobble boards. They do slide boards back to uh, side to side to basically rebuild that balance, rebuild that proprioception. And it's harder than you think, I promise. So I'm a big fan of physical therapy after any ankle sprain, be it your first or your fourth like Ray to try to not just get over it faster, but to try to prevent this from happening again in the future. Yes, there are injury prevention programs like uh, we've heard about and talked about really for ACL injuries. There's programs that also help with trying to prevent ankle sprains. Uh, you know, back to the taping, there are some studies that show even in people that have never had an ankle sprain, maybe wearing a lace-up ankle brace can prevent injuries. Again, that's sort of controversial, but I will throw that out there. Some people are very uh, adamant about it. And then I think the last thing that's important, coming full circle, we talked about seeing a doctor getting an x-ray, but if you're having recurrent ankle sprains, it could be that at a certain point, those ligaments just are too stretched out to stabilize the ankle, and yeah, sometimes getting surgery to reconstruct those ligaments is a good thing. Orthopedic surgeons, especially those that specialize in foot and ankle surgery, might be able to basically rebuild those ligaments using tendon grafts and there's a variety of ways that they can do it and sometimes that can be really helpful. Yes, it's a long way to go, it's an operation, it's a long recovery, but if that gets you back playing your sport and minimizes the chance of a new injury, that's not always a bad thing. Have you had ankle sprains and they happen over and over again? How did you get over it? What steps did you take to heal the injury to prevent them from happening again? I would love to hear your experience. So below this video, share your experience. I would love to read them and I bet people dealing with ankle sprains all over the world would love to read them as well. If you like uh, videos like this and you want more information on sports and exercise injuries, injury treatments, injury prevention, 
Subscribe to my video channel. I record a couple of these videos every single week and I'll deliver them directly you, uh, to you. So subscribe uh, by clicking the button in the upper right corner of the page and I'll get those to you. Really excited to interact with you that way. And if you have questions about sports or exercise injuries or maybe uh, your friends or your family have had sports and exercise injuries, send those questions my way and I'll try to answer them in an upcoming Ask Dr. Geyer video. Thank you so much for watching. Again, if you've had an ankle sprain, I'd love to hear how you got over it. And I look forward to seeing you right here next time.